Hello students, let's continue with polynomials. Today we will be talking about factorization of polynomials. Now there are two ways to factorize polynomials, namely the first one being splitting the middle term and the other one is by using the factor theorem. or also the hit and trial method. So let's take a look at what is how to factorize a polynomial using the uh, splitting the term method. Let's say you have a polynomial quadratic polynomial x square plus mx plus c. So here as you can see m is the middle term. I am going to split m in such a way into two, into two parts say m1 and m2 in such a way that when you add m1 and m2 you get m and m1 into m2 will give you c. Right? Now this is when you do not have a coefficient for x square what if you have a coefficient for x square let us say it's, it is a so a x square plus m x plus c again you are going to split your middle term into two components m1 and m2 such that adding m1 and m2 will give you m, m and m1 into m2 will give you a into c here it is a into c because you have a coefficient for x square here the coefficient of x square is 1 therefore it is c the other or else 1 into c which will give you c now we will take a look at an uh, look we will take a look at an example a solved example from your textbook so factorize 6x square plus 17x plus 5 by splitting the middle term. So now you have to split 17 in such a way that you get 6 into 5. Uh, you have to split 17 into two components m1, m2 such that m1 into m2 will give you 6 into 5 which is 30 okay and adding m1 and m2 will give you 17. So let us say m1 into m2 is equal to 6 into 5 right 6 5s are 30 now 6 and 5 will not really sum up to 17 how about 15 2s are so 15 into 2 will give you 30 plus 15 and 2 adding it up will give you 17 So, 6x square plus 2x plus 15x plus 5, right? I am going to take two terms at a time. Here, what is common between these two terms? 2x. So, you are left with 3x plus 1. What is common here? 5. So, you are left with 3x plus 1, right? So, this is 3x plus 1 into 2x plus 5. Thus, we have factorized 6x square plus 17x plus 5 as a product of two factors which is 3x plus 1 and 2x plus 5. So, 3x plus 1 is a factor of 6x plus 17x plus 5 as well as 2x plus 5 is a factor of this polynomial or vice versa you can say that 6x square plus 17x plus 5 is a multiple of 3x plus 1 as well as it is a multiple of 2x plus 5.
Thank you. Hope this video increased your knowledge. For more such videos and a completely free educational content, log on to www.epathshala.org or visit our Epathshala YouTube channel. We have each and every question solved for maths, physics, chemistry and biology. So subscribe our channel, share with your friends, like our Facebook page and follow our Twitter handle for regular updates and important educational tips and also win Epathshala goodies. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe this channel and enjoy the freedom of education.